Got this for the XRT garage light extra battery mount strap and this one's going to get changed out I don't want this no more this junk we're gonna change it out to this one Pro line brute. Put this on. I prefer these hoods over that crap. And there's the other ones like Basher Queen, I think, or an M2C. They got some good ones too. But it's like that. Oh. Product number PRO three five one three one seven hundred and forty bucks. Come with stickers, you know. All them stickers that go on there. So I'm gonna do that. Put them on where I want stickers and uh, transfer all this stuff from this one I might just leave this one off I don't think I'm gonna use it I'm these are waste of money man they don't last long so I won't put it back on this one I'll just leave the um, you know the bumper one yeah take this all off change it out screws there and up here there and it'll come off and just put it to this one and put it back same way won't take long but yep I think I'll uh, transfer all these stuff on to this, then I'll put stickers. And I'm done. Oh, another thing with my... Uh, I don't know if you could see in there, it's... Plastic cub now. The uh, aluminum one. I kept breaking... Uh, kept breaking the... Um, pins you know and it's it was wallowed out and it was snapping the pins you know I'm sending mine pretty far and high and they'll wear out they wear out I mean you know that up from Anchorage House Hobbies. Yeah. Come I in. You're okay these hoods for a while, but they start cracking and crinkling and, and you know that's a lot of hits on the back. So I'm not too happy with it really. I already mentioned it in one of my videos that I would change them out, change it out anyway. Later on down the road. Do 
something more ultimate. some money these are a waste of money man don't buy them but you can buy what you want your money <laughs> but my experience piece of junk and a junk for sure man real junk Junk product. Cost too much for a cheap product from Tractus. It's kind of ridiculous. Take this chunk. Some stickers here, there, there, a few other ones, you know, just to make it look more trucky. Finally got parts coming for this Creighton. Uh, I'm going to put it up for sale. Get rid of it. I'm done with this. It's, it's a cool rig, but it's not durable, man. It breaks too easy. Keeping this one. I'm keeping this. This one's going. Keeping this one, the part coming for it in the mail. This one I'm gonna probably sell too. Sell that. I'll probably keep these two. Yeah, I'm definitely keeping those two. This one's going and the Asuga's going. I'm, yeah, I'm done YouTubing. Probably my last video, you know, takes time away from family and doing other stuff. So I don't want to deal with that anymore. Just enjoy it, you know, I want to enjoy it without, you know, making a video and doing stuff at my own expense for, you know, people to watch. It's getting old, it costs too much money, you know. But yep, this is probably the last video I'm making on YouTube for a while. I'll maybe post a few now and then, but nothing crazy like before. But I'm gonna finish putting these stickers on. Yeah, that's it, man. I'm 
getting rid of that crate in there. That's not as durable. Brakes too easy. I mean, you've seen my other video with this one, how I was really, really bashing this one. This one would not even last, you know, the brake. I'm selling this one here and getting rid of this one. Suga. Definitely keeping this one. Uh, I don't know if I'd want to sell it. It's uh, one of my best rigs I had. You know, it, it, it broke, but it took a while to break. I mean, I really, really rallied this one. And this one here, yeah. It proved itself, man. The way I... Abused it. That's my opinion. If I were to buy again, and if I were to pick one and buy one again, I'd buy this one over this. This one's, uh, yeah, it's not as durable as they say, you know, EXP. Broke all the arms. You know, I put an M2C uh, bulk thing in there, the AAB block. Changed the wing mount to a garage life one. It's a good rig, but no, it's not for me. You know, I had, uh, it's just people are saying about the Outcast 8 and uh, Creighton. No, those were, those were junk. I don't want to bash on you. I mean, there's a lot of people who like them, but, you know, make them bad, but just not for me. You know, run a little while and break. That was not very enjoyable. So I sold those too. But this one here, it had its breaks, but they were during the winter. Now it was summertime, you know, man. I, I thought I'd be breaking arms. Nope, they held up. I was surprised, and I did break one one of the plastic, uh, you know, these ones. But I changed them to aluminum, and I changed the towers to aluminum. But yeah, this thing takes a beat, and it's still um, very impressed. I'd get this one over this in a heartbeat. This one's okay, I mean, electronics-wise, okay, you know, stock. These are fine. I mean, I've seen a lot of people, you know, those all fancy controllers and all that. No, I just run them with the remotes they come with. Run them until they can't run no more. <clears throat> I don't want to waste no more any more money on a controller, you know. I run them how they come. I enjoy them, I had no issues. You know, a lot of people gotta change their receiver and all that crap, but that's not me. I run them the way they are when they come and I get them. I'm still debating if I should keep this, but I might just wash her up, clean her, Put some double E forty silicone on her, look, make her look shiny again, and put up for sale. Same with this one. <clears throat> I'm still debating on these two if I should sell one of them, but I like both of them. <laughs> so, so I don't know. But anyways, that's it. Last video. I'll. Uh, I'll show on, or I'll put a picture when that's all done, but last video for a while, I'm, yeah, I'm done with YouTubing. It's too much, too much, too much to please at my own expense, you know. And, yeah, it's just, it's getting old. I gotta cut back, it costs money. Cut back and enjoy, you know, myself. 
and my shop local shop I think they might be closing down too but yeah I got a whole bunch of X Mac X Max parts up there man lots and um, some extra servos I got the upgraded one like I put in that one one just give what I'll put in here and I got uh, another beef I think it's a beef one I put on my Creighton I'm in that Creighton Kagama but I think it was a 800 or something one of the stronger ones than that yeah sucks they're gonna be closing that's part of the reason too kind of you gotta cut back cut back on YouTube and then enjoy it myself to myself sounds selfish but yeah I want to enjoy it myself and have more free time with the family so sit no uh, sit on the X Max last video, but this is what I'm gonna be running. Ain't that cheap shit from Traxxas? All right, well, that's it later.